0 and 1 to Saladino. On the ground, Kloof is going to come home. And Johnson saved. He slipped around the tag by Suzuki, and Suzuki immediately looks into the Twins' dugout. Home plate umpire Marty Foster explaining to Suzuki, who remains convinced that he got the tag on the runner, Micah Johnson. And they're going to take a look at it. There's a sliding lane necessary. Well, he never touched home plate. <laughs> Other than that, he's safe. <laughs> Right hand goes away from the plate. The left hand still hasn't touched the plate. So we are of the belief that Johnson will be called out here. The first one we saw, I thought, was a uh, really good look. I think the uh, the umpire Marty Foster thought that the right hand got to the plate. That's what all I can all I can figure. You look at his right hand right here, and Foster behind. The only thing I can figure is that. Right there, he's tagging. Yeah, the thigh. That, that maybe. Well, he either thought the Kurt missed him, or that the right hand hit the plate earlier. That's that's the only way you can make that call that he did. Well, this call should be overturned. Home plate umpire to your right, Mike Winters, the crew chief. First base umpire in this case is the umpire on the left. And again, there has to be convincing evidence. We believe there was. And out is the call. Well, seven run lead. Kloof, rather than taking the sure out across the diamond, decided to come home. And they did get the lead runner. Saladino reaches on a fielder's choice. Two down.